friends welcome to cns view point today we are going to talk about an important thought provoking thing which uh, uh, big inspiration dr patricia lambert said in john hopkins uh, university bloomberg school of public health institute of tobacco global tobacco control so 2022 south asia tobacco control leadership course so she said that if tobacco in a hypothetical situation if tobacco industry had come today in 2022 with a product like tobacco then it could not have been a legal entity it could not have been a legal industry do you think governments will allow a product an industry to sell a product which kills one out of two tobacco users as because the who says tobacco kills one out of two users one of the two people who use tobacco die of tobacco related diseases as per the world health organization the un health agency so will it will governments allow such an industry to operate will governments allow any industry to sell a product um, legally which uh, causes diseases like cardiovascular diseases biggest killer on the planet earth like uh, cancers like diabetes like tuberculosis which is the most uh, kid deadly infectious disease <coughs> including which increases the risk of for covid-19 <coughs> chronic respiratory diseases which pollutes our planet which is a single man made pollutant in the oceans and so much more harm so which lies with deceives so will will such a industry be a legal entity no of course not governments will not allow i believe any industry to sell a product which harms its own people you know and if it kills their own people then of course that industry has to be brought to account we have legal and policy framework to do, <coughs> to ensure corporate accountability and that has to become a norm so let us hope that governments will rather hold to tobacco industry legally and financially liable make it pay for the harm the uh, uh, you know and damage it has caused irreparable damage it has caused to human lives and our planet and uh, and this <coughs> deadly industry and industries like tobacco industry cannot operate like a legal entity <coughs> they have to be brought to uh, you know co- uh, account they have to be held accountable and liable and let us hope that happens sooner than later the time is running out we are losing more than 8 million lives every single year if each of those lives matter then uh, the urgency and the sense of purpose we should drive the action against the tobacco industry uh, is uh, must become very evident i hope it does with this hope i will end today's cns few point um, and i will be back again friends tomorrow like every day at 5 pm india time with a thoughts and views and perspectives on something that made us think bye till then and thanks a lot for watching cns few point bye bye